Hi viewers, welcome to our channel. In this video, we'll discuss about types of form work based on materials and structure components. First, we discuss about introduction. In construction industry, form work is very similar to the mold because the concrete members are cast in different shapes and sizes using different types of materials. Also, it should have sufficient strength to carry dead load and live load coming on to the casting operation and after that till concrete gets hardened and gains some percentage of strength. Various types of shattering used in construction industry are listed below. Based on the material we have timber, steel, aluminium, plastic etc. And based on the structural members we have wall, beam, foundation, column and slab form work. So this is the introduction. If you want to know what is the difference between shattering and centering also staging you can watch our recent video i will give a link in the description and also in the i button please go and watch and then come to this video next timber form work the timber form work is one of the mostly used in the construction industry because it can be fabricated on the site and it is easy to produce but time consuming for large structures plywood phasing has a short lifespan timber is easy to fix remove and lightweight also this timber shattering is most flexible and type of shattering it can be used for any shape and any size okay timber shattering should satisfy the following requirements it should be lightweight well seasoned free from termite attacks and easily workable advantages of using this timber form work Timber shattering is easy to construct for any shape, size and height. Also it is economical for small projects and it can be easily molded into any shape or size. Also it can be constructed using locally available timber. It is lightweight as compared to steel or aluminium shattering. Next we talk about steel foam work. Steel foam work now becoming more popular due to its long life and multiple time reusers. So steel shattering gives very smooth finishes to the concrete. It is also suitable for circular and curved surfaces such as tanks, columns, chimneys, sewer tunnels and retaining walls etc. Advantages of steel form work over timber. Steel shattering is strong and durable and has longer life. It gives very smooth finish to the surface of the member. Also it is waterproof and minimizes the honeycombing effect. Also it can be used more than 100 times also steel form work can be installed and dismantled with greater ease next aluminum form work this aluminum form work is similar in many aspects as the steel form work aluminum form work are lighter than the steel forms due to low density and this is their primal advantage when compared to the steel the shattering is economical if large number of repeating usage are made in the construction also disadvantages is that no alteration is possible once the formwork is constructed on the site. Next plastic formwork. Plastic formwork is a lightweight modular interlocking system and can be used more than 100 times. It can be used for simple concrete structures. Also this type of shattering is becoming popular for similar size shape and large housing schemes. Advantages of plastic formwork. It is lightweight shattering, hence requires less handling cost. It can be used for large sections. It is carefully transported and used. Multiple reusers are possible, making it highly economical. Next, other types of formworks are available in the market. They are fabric formwork. Fabric formwork is emerging technology in shattering industry for constructing of irregular shapes and complex members. These flexibility of this material makes it possible to produce concrete at any shape. Next coffer formwork. This formwork stay in place formwork system. It is composed of two filtering grades which is reinforced by vertical stiffeners and linked by articulated connections. So which can be folded to transport on the side. Coffer remains in place after concrete is poured and acts as reinforcement. So coffer is transported to the site, fabricated from the factory. So this type of shattering can be used for any type of structures like multi-story buildings, houses or etc. 
Next, based on the structural components, we have wall formwork and beam and slab formwork. Wall formwork used for concreting of shear or RCC walls in dams, wing walls, basement of RCC walls, etc. And beam and slab formwork are used for beams and slabs. Beam and slab formworks are the most important members in RCC frame structures. So these beam and slab formwork has prefabricated formwork includes sheeting bottom and side panel sheets. So next we have foundation formwork, column formwork. In the foundation formwork, these are designed according to the foundation type like combining footing, wrap footing, etc. Basically there is a difference between the design for individual foundations. So the shuttering also will be different. Next column formwork. Formwork arrangement for column may differ on basis of column outline like rectangular, circular or hexagonal or any other shape. So basically these are types of formwork. If you have any doubts regarding this video, you can comment below. We will give a reply within 24 hours. And don't forget to subscribe our channel, also click the bell icon. See you in the next video. Thank you.